Here's how to add a card to your Apple Pay wallet. Now, the first thing we need to do is swipe all the way over to the left on your iPhone here and get to the app library. And we need to search for the wallet app itself. So there it is, a default app, tap on wallet. You can see I already have a card on here, Bank of America, but let's add a new card just by tapping the little plus. And now we will add a debit or credit card midway down. Now I have my other credit card here. You can see here is my credit card. I don't wanna show you the number, but there is my credit card. I'm gonna just hit continue here. And the cool thing is it says hold near your card. So you can get the little chip at the very front and hold it near the kind of top of your iPhone. You might need to move it around a bit, but there you can see it just recognized the card. So I'm good to go. I don't need that card anymore. It read all the details. I can hit agree on here and it will go through the process of adding this credit card or debit card to my Apple wallet. I'll show you what it looks like and a couple of things you wanna turn on in the settings afterwards as well. So there you go and see it added this card. Let's just hit next. It will just verify it with a text message here and you're good to go. It might ask you if you wanna set this as default. In this case, I'm gonna keep my other card as default. So let's just keep it like this. Now it's added on here. You can see recent transactions, but I'm gonna hop out of here and open up my settings next. In the settings, I can scroll down until I find the option for wallet and Apple Pay. And now from here, you can see payment cards. There is that business blue cash that I just added. You wanna make sure double click side button is turned on. If that's turned off, then you'll have a hard time pulling up that Apple Pay or Apple Wallet. So turn that on. And then also go back and tap on face ID and passcode and just enter that passcode in and make sure contactless and payments is turned on for your face ID. So if that's turned off, just toggle it on. Now I'll show you how it works. Let's hop out of here and let's say you're checking out somewhere and buying something. You're just gonna double click this side button really fast. You can see it pops up with your card. You can see I can switch between the different cards. Just tap on whichever one I wanna use. It'll use my face ID because I've turned that on and I can hold it near an NFC reader like a pay station or something at a coffee shop, grocery store, et cetera.